Well, the time has come. The holidays are here. And amongst other awesome things, that means it's time for those holiday work parties. My wife, for instance, has one every year. It is a formal event. And yes, I could probably go with one of the same suits that I've worn in the previous years. But sometimes I feel like doing something new. And to be honest... I'm not a rich man. I don't have a ton of money to shell out for suits, you know, go to the store and spend $500, $600, $700 a pop just to wear it to one work party. And really, that's just the truth of it. I don't have a ton of money to spend on things like that. But today, I'm going to show you how I fix that. I'm going to show you a couple of mid-range budget items that I think make for awesome holiday party or formal event outfits. All right, so this is the second of two videos that I announced a while back on the clothing site True Clothing. They're from the UK. If you remember, I did a video not too long ago about some winter wear items. We looked at some of their jackets. I mean, it was a pretty cool video. We looked at some awesome stuff. So I'm gonna put that one up here at the top for you guys if you missed that. But if you've never heard of this brand and you haven't seen any of my previously made content on this website, what they are is they are a website out of the UK and they, I think they're most known for their Peaky Blinders inspired suits. They have those really classic tweed suits. I didn't really want to keep doing the Peaky Blinder thing. I did two videos on it. I, I just didn't want to keep going with the Peaky Blinders theme. So I wanted to explore some of the other things that they have on their site and why I specifically enjoy their site. Now today's suits, I guess, could be argued as slightly Peaky Blinder-ish. I mean, they are tweed suits, but I went a different way with them. I chose different style ones that I think are, I guess they could be argued that they would have worn. They're still kind of vintage looking, but I went for color schemes and patterns and things like that that I don't think I normally would have picked had I been making a Peaky Blinder inspired look. I went with ones that I thought fit into the category of holiday parties and you know really trying to get the best bang for your buck as far as outfits go. Now, before I show you my picks, I do want to quickly explain what I meant by mid-range budget because you know I, I think a lot of times on YouTube you see how how to get a good outfit on a budget and I my last video actually did that too. get some winter wear on a budget this one here is what I would consider to be kind of mid-range budget meaning it's not super cheap but it's not super expensive either you know I'm comparing these suits to the last time I actually went to a suit shop which was about 500 bucks for the suit 70 for the shirt maybe another hundred bucks for the shoes so altogether we got you know 670 bucks at least maybe even closer to 700 bucks total that I spent there on that suit so I wanted to find something that wasn't quite that expensive but there was still a limit to what I was willing to do because you know we could all find a suit for a hundred 150 bucks online but the fabric is super thin. They, they look cheap. I mean, it's obvious you don't want to walk into a party wearing the $50 suit. I mean, you, you might as well have a sign on you at that point. Everybody can pretty much tell. So what I'm going to show you here are what I call mid-range budget items. One of them is $197. The other is $297 after conversion from the British pound. So, and remember, this is a brand from the UK. So when you go to their site, their prices are are in British pounds. So you have to take into consideration that when you're looking it over. Again, we do have two suits to look at. We also have a bonus outfit here at the end. So make sure you watch all the way to the end to see that. The first suit that I chose here though is a three piece tweed navy blue checkered suit. And what you get when you buy from their site is just the three pieces itself plus the pocket square. So the shirt and the tie are all separate, but they do carry those on the site. Everything I'm showing you here is found on their site. And really what drew me to this particular suit was one it's warm it's a tweed suit so it's nice and warm and gives off that specialized tweed look I just love the way tweed looks and I love the colors of the suit overall and I really like how it has this blue injected in there with the buttons and then of course the tie and pocket square gives it a nice accent as well it's just a nice and versatile suit I feel like it's perfect for this type of event or even a more formal event like a wedding if you need it you could even if you wanted to drop the tie and make it less formal while still 
still keeping things classy. I think that looks fantastic as well. Next, now we are going to take it up a notch with this next pick, and this one might be a bit too much for a holiday party, but I love the look of this suit, so I would 100% do it. I mean, check this thing out. This is their three-piece herringbone tweed vintage-inspired blue and tan suit. Once again, we have that classic tweed fabric, which is just something I freaking love for some reason. Again, here you're seeing everything from their site, but when you buy the suit, it comes with just the three pieces and the pocket square. As far as wearing it, this came right out of the box looking just like this. There was no tailoring done to it whatsoever, and I think when you put this on, you go to the party, I think it's guaranteed to just turn some heads. The only issue you might have is you might get too much attention for this one, to be honest. Sometimes it's not bad to be the best dressed one in the room. It's That's not necessarily a bad thing. Again, I just love the way the colors contrast and complement each other. I think it brings together a really clean and exciting look. Once again, with this one too, you can change it up a little bit and open the collar up to make it not quite as formal. And I think for this suit specifically, it is a fantastic option. Now we do have a bonus outfit, like I mentioned. This is one that I put together last minute when I saw this sweater on their site. I just came across it just looking through stuff on their site and I just thought I love the way this sweater looks and I can think of you know about five different outfits we could put together with it so I decided to make this one a bonus take a look at this here real quick all I did was I took this sweater this awesome looking sweater and I dressed it up a bit using one of the dress shirts from the suits that we just looked at and I paired it with a standard black tie and black slacks I think this is not only the most cost effective out of the three outfits but I think this is also a really good option for someone who doesn't necessarily want to go with a full-on three-piece or even two-piece suit. Now that sweater, by the way, the one that you just saw is only $18.89 in US dollars. It's really affordable. And as far as size goes, I, I would advise that you size up, meaning you order a size larger than you're used to. I, I th do think it's a little bit snug. That would be the only criticism I have of it. But for the price, I mean, it, it's, it's fantastic for the price. And speaking of price and quality, I get this a lot. For the suits, are they the same quality as a suit that you're going to pay five, 600 bucks for obviously not i mean nobody's trying to fool anyone here these are you know 200 and our 200 suit and a 300 suit so you're getting what you're paying for however i do think that they're good for that price they're not thin material they're nice and thick material they don't look cheap they don't feel cheap they don't fall apart and they actually come fitting quite well usually the only thing that i have to tailor is the pants which is actually something that i have to do all the time anyway with pants it's not just from these guys even when I bought the really expensive suit, I had to get the jacket and pants tailored. But this one, when they come, I really like that when they, they arrive on the door, besides the pants, you can just take them out of the box, you can throw it on and you can wear it and it fits really nicely. If you do want to check out these picks or anything else from True Clothing, I will have links in the description along with the sizes that I chose. I will put the sizes for everything that I chose in the description there. And I also have a special code to you guys from True Clothing that doesn't get me a commission or anything like that. It's just a, a code from True Clothing that they offered you guys, my subscribers. And when you use it, you actually get a free scarf with your order. So I think that's pretty cool. I do want to thank True Clothing for allowing me to check out their site once again and give you guys my opinion. They're very awesome for letting me do that, so I really appreciate that. That is, though, all I got for today. If you'd be so kind as to like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff, that's a huge help to me, especially subscribing. That's a big one. I will be back with you guys here next week with an all-new Behind the Brew, too, so make sure you keep an eye out for that. Maybe turn on that bell icon so you get notified when I drop it. I do think you guys are really going to enjoy that one, so I'm going to get going on that, get that out to you guys guys as fast as possible. I hope everyone has a fantastic weekend. Take it easy. I'll see you next time.